Guys, it's Rich here at the Ultra Motorsports Warehouse in Fort Wayne, Indiana. Um, <clears throat> we're looking at this 1970 Volkswagen Beetle. This vehicle has underwent a complete nut and bolt restoration, okay? Um, we're just gonna do a little walk around to kinda uh, just no, note any blemishes or anything like that. I do wanna bring everybody over here to a couple of these pictures real quick though, okay? What we got here is, so we got the car when it, when it rolled in to wherever it was getting restored, all right? And then we got the paintwork here put back together, but we can see the car down to bare metal right here. And then we got brand new floor plans in the car also. So, I mean, the, the amount of work done on this thing is just, this is definitely, hey, I, I, I really love this thing rather than I'm, I'm doing this to make money because, I mean, look at, you know, you can't, we got powder coated body parts, or excuse me, um, we've got uh, either poor 15 or probably powder coated uh, suspension parts and things like that. So somebody really, really took some time and did this thing up, all right? So what we're gonna do is, <clears throat> we'll just do like all of our videos. <clears throat> all of our videos kind of start right here at the driver's side front. And then we're just gonna kind of inspect the car. Mind you, you know, I mean, I got a body shop here too. So there's, there's always gonna be some dust and stuff like that on all my cars. But uh, I do wanna look at the chrome and uh, some of the other um, items on the car to just to um, point to anything that could be a blemish or anything like that. So first impression, um, paint is glossy, nice, definitely uh, base coat, clear coat, um, looks really nice. We've got kind of these tricked out little bumpers here, right? Then the um, chrome looks good, those are chromed. Bezels look really good on the chrome here. Uh, I don't see any runs or any uh, fish eyes in the paint on first glance. I can obviously look at the pictures you can tell, but you can also tell this car was obviously taken 100% apart to be, to be restored. So um, as we look down the side of the car, any body work that was done, looks like it got laid out really, really straight, okay? Fit looks good. All the gaskets look very supple, good looking, okay? Good looking here, really supple, like new type um, window felt, window squeegee, all that stuff in here. Look at this, this stuff looks like brand new in there, right? You see this, it's like brand new. Um, all the stainless looks great. Uh, chrome door handles, not pitted anywhere, obviously brand new, okay? So a lot of new parts. Fit looks really good. And then as we look at, um, these are a little just, uh, uh, they're chalky like they're new but they are in excellent condition like brand new um gas uh, gaskets weather stripping excuse me <clears throat> all the soft rubber parts are excellent uh window tint added to the thing looks really sharp as you look at the um, rear of the vehicle the rear quarter you can see i'm not going to say that the car probably you know so um this car could probably use some wax, I mean, for sure, okay? Uh, I don't, there's no, there's no, there's no bad areas, okay? But uh, it looks like it's been a while since this thing's had a coat of wax on it. So that's something that we can certainly do before any prospective buyer takes delivery. Uh, uh, it's probably on the list to be done as it is, so. Uh, dual exhaust. <coughs> Got a little upgraded, tricked out wheels here. Brand new tires. As we look in here at some of these suspension parts, here's where we see... And like I said, my shop's a little dusty, but here's where we see that these are like new parts. I mean, new, new in there, right? Everything's looking very, very nice, okay? Um, we can look under the car a little bit here too and see where er no, no typical VW rust, okay? Looks like brand new under here. Yeah, very, very nice, very tidy. Yeah, yeah, real, real good. All very nice. So, uh, the engine, not the original engine, I believe, uh, is upgraded to a 1900 uh, cc engine. So, got some dress up parts in here. Thing runs and drives like a little beast. So, it's really, really fun little car to drive. Not too much, not too little, just right. So, really, really uh, um, good positive upgrade for the car. Rear tail lights are in great shape. No cracking, no uh, not dried out or old. Uh, as we look down the body of the car this way, again, um, 
looks like it's all laid out very straight, okay? The fit looks very good. So if somebody really took the time. I'm trying to look for blemishes in the paint, actually, and I got a little dust or scuzz right here, but um, I'm trying to look for some blemishes in the paint, and I just can't really seem to find any right now. You can kind of catch where what I'm saying the car might need a little polish. If you look in the, this is all just like dried up wax or something on the car, but you should see how you got like this little hazy spider web type deal, right? I mean, I'm standing, now, mind you, I look at cars all day long, okay? So this, you know, we have a body shop, a restoration shop here. <clears throat> you would have to be a professional to know what I'm talking about right now when you look at this car. Everyone that comes into my shop says, that little thing is gorgeous, okay? I, uh, I, would, I would polish it a little bit, give it a quick polish first, just because it looks like, you know, somebody's washed it a few times in the driveway and, and it's just, it's got what, what cars get on it right? Cars need polish. That's all there is to it. So uh, as we look at the front passenger side, looks very tidy up here also. Chrome is good. Gaskets are all good. Everything is nice and soft and neat. Okay. Um, lift up the uh, spare tire area. Spare tire cover looks great. Car was taken completely apart to be done. All this stuff looks like new. Fuel tank looks great. Everything looks very nice. Okay. So, really, really good. You know, we look into some of these areas down here, you know, and, and everything just looks really good. Look down there at like the Vintag, you know. It's nice to see the Vintag didn't come off the car ever during the restoration. It was kind of just worked around. So, really nice. Let's look at the interior a little bit. <clears throat> open both doors here okay so interior door panels not much to say here guys all this stuff looks brand new okay looks like new got some neat little graphics on the on the dash upgraded stereo uh, headliner is like new we got a like a silver headliner in here okay looks like new seats like new, uh, looks real, real nice, okay? So, passenger side door, pardon me, I'm just gonna walk over here real quick. Passenger side door, panel, looks excellent. Um, carpets look great. It's got kind of a little upgraded shifter in it. It's kind of fun, kind of cool. Upgraded little gauge pack, looks pretty hot, nice. All the other stuff is here, right? All the little buttons, all the little things. We got we got uh, little upgraded speakers on either side. Very, very tastefully done. Look very nice. The dash is in excellent condition. I've got the seat pulled up here in the back so we can see underneath here. We can see uh, exhaust, we can see the battery area, we can see all this stuff, all right? Um, the rear seat is in great shape and I just wanted to kind of also show uh, the um, excuse me I wanted to also show the sound deadening that's in this thing also so not only did we do you know a great job of restoring this vehicle but then you know did the extra and just you know put the sound deadener in and and all that uh, so it looks really really nice and 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 definitely uh, helps the vehicle to sound a little bit better and uh, just be a little bit more enjoyable vehicle to drive so what we'll do is we'll uh get this seat and you guys can see the pictures i'll get that seat jammed back in there for you um uh, after i'm done here but uh the pictures on the website show the back seat and the rear door panels and rear seat uh, are in great shape <clears throat> guys that's it uh, these vi this video took about half as long as the rest of my videos. Obviously, it's about half the car compared to some of these other ones. So, half the size anyway. Definitely not half the quality. Things in great shape. 1970 uh, Volkswagen Beetle. Upgraded engine, 100% restored. And for sale at the Ultra Motorsports Warehouse in Fort Wayne, Indiana. Reach out to us on the web at ultramotors.net. Um, and... Uh, my name is Rich. You can reach me via my cell through the listing also. Thanks.